Which way? Welcome back. We have returned. My precious. Did you hear that? Um, no. What, what am I supposed to be hearing? Um, I just thought I heard something weird. I know you picked up that, that weird gold ring the other day when we were in that cave system that we were exploring. Mm-hmm. Uh, <coughs> oh, excuse it me. Hasn't, uh, it hasn't been whispering <coughs> to you by, by chance, has it? Of course not. <laughs> oh, good. Shh. Hmm? What? Oh, so a settler. Shut up, stupids. What'd you say? Are. What? <laughs> you don't touch anything. And you close the door. And Ellie's going to touch everything. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Gear up. All right. Uh uh. What? Uh. Get a gun. Like <laughs> dope. Joel. I forgot how no. Dad. Like yeah, pretty much. Stay here. It's fine. Just wait around for you two to get me killed. Besides, if we gave you a gun, you just pull a test and start shooting every time we get into conflict with clickers. It's up there. How in the hell is Tess okay with this suicide mission? She's been pretty quiet about it lately. <laughs> Broad's not as smart as I thought she was. What? Fucker. Seriously, you gotta take this kid back to where you found her. I can't just take this kid back. Then send her packing, let her find her own way. It's about Maybe how I feel about her. <laughs> Laid on that, but yeah. Yeah. I, I just had to absorb it. Before. It's okay. You get your shotgun now, that's what I was focusing on. Partner. Somebody I had to look after. Domestic partner. This oh. one good for one thing. Drop the bomb! <laughs> Drop the booze. I realize it's got to be just me. Bill, it ain't, it ain't like that. It's bullshit. It's just like that. No, seriously, Tess is. Hey, Tess is not like that. Steps. What'd I say? I'm just fixing your. In fact, I'd say she's up, six feet away from uh, that. It's one of my favorite parts. <laughs> I keep babysitting long enough, and eventually it's gonna blow up in Bill. your face. Can you please just get on. Just get on with it. Just get on with it. Yep. Say hello to my boomstick. <laughs> that was me spinning it around. You know who else would be really good in this Cordyceps apocalypse? Ashley Williams. Why? Because he can... Oh, you need to get those tools before you start crafting. Yeah, um... Looking for other stuff, then. Because he is amazing at situations like this. A note. Cordyceps infected people will be like nothing compared to dead a note. No, it was paper. And uh, he also has like the mechanical chainsaw hand. Perfect. Oh, we could we could do the dead the guy from uh, Resident Evil Five. Um. The Resident uh, Five. Chris Redfield. No, not Chris. Uh, the chainsaw. Boss at the very beginning. Oh, that dude in that village that has a chainsaw. That doesn't have a name, as far as I remember. <laughs> it's black. <laughs> so, it's weapon not. holster, or. Yeah. You have 126 parts? Oh, that's more than enough for this. Yeah, weapon holster's definitely worth it. Reload speed, rate of fire. Rate of fire, definitely. Yeah, because you miss enough that you really need to be able to fire it. And again. clip capacity, please. If you even have the rounds to put in there. Yeah. That looks good. That looks good. Okay, now I'm carrying two guns. Two oh. handguns? Can you dual wield them all, uh. No, you can't. Bulletproof monk style? As, like, doves fly around you and the music's like. No. No, you cannot. That's a shame. Have you ever seen that movie? Bulletproof Mode? Nope. It's on Netflix, though. It was decent. I say that about a lot of movies. I doubt it was decent. That's <laughs> no, alright. The acting was terrible, but the action was pretty good. I love these things. Nail bombs? So useful. Especially when you can uh, leave them as landmines. Oh yeah. Are you getting chased by somebody? You just drop them right inside a doorway. 
keep running and you just hear boom. You can make another one. And look out, there's sharp pointed objects on that bomb I'm carrying in my hand. <laughs> so now we're out looking for a battery. Hmm, <sighs> that tastes the like wing stop. I haven't been able to make a Molotov. I was going to make an alkaline joke. Now it doesn't really seem appropriate. It doesn't seem what? Appropriate. Appropriate, okay. That's my room. Hey, wait, hold on, hold on. Go back. What? You need to go back and like stand inside that pulpit area right there. And then look out. Like, go on the other side and look out at the... the Crowd, humor me here. Go on the other side of the pulpit and look out at that. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to marry. No, oh, come on! I was gonna marry <laughs> Bill in a piece of wood. Ah, uh, darn! I wish I could have heard. Because we all know how much Bill loves pieces of wood. Hmm. Bob no. Group of runners triggered most of the bombs on the south side of town. It's time to do another pass. Don't forget to mark the map with all bomb locations. <sighs> you didn't say that right. What was I supposed to say? You, get, you had to say it louder because it was capitalized. With all bomb locations! Okay, there you go. Let's try not to kill all our sack listeners. Up. Time to sack up. It's one of my favorite, like, redneck terms. <laughs> sack up, boy. What about get her done? No, that's just something that stupid it's dude from Ohio made up. Larry the Cable Guy. I, I realize that's his name. I was trying to make sure I had the name right. I really dislike that phrase, and it's become so commonplace now that it aggravates me. I done got her did, boy. <laughs> Although, there's only been one time that I found it appropriate, and that was in the uh, DBC Abridged. <laughs> when did that happen? <laughs> With uh, Captain Ginyu and his uh, his terrible nightmare. Yeah. And then oh, this is one of the harder it's ones. It's time to get her done. Shh. I'm trying! No, it's not quiet enough. It's gotta be quieter. It's right there. Are you quiet enough to kill it? Are you mad enough to stop the bad dude? Oh, it's not right. Hold on. I'll get this right. Are you a bad enough dude to rescue the president and kill the people? That's not right. Hmm. Excuse me. Wow, Bill! What happened to sneaking around, huh? We were all trying to be quiet, and then you just start yelling and firing a shotgun? I don't know what to think of this guy anymore. Throw the stealth mission out the window. What? Speaking of terrible, inaccurate deaths, we need to pause it. Already? Yeah. Oh. Bye-bye.